Studio tour. You heard that correct. We're gonna start off by not talking about my awful paint job because holy f that looks bad but i was in a rush when i moved in i had to get the work and to be fair i have more lights on just for this video than i normally do so you'll see things i usually don't unfortunately but let's start off with the first thing you notice as soon as you walk in the room this sign now my wife got me this on etsy she just put the backlit sign and it worked it was great um and also the chesterfield couch it's definitely not a casting couch unless you're trying to audition for something let me know now on each side of the sign i just have sconces that i put like the flicker bulbs in as well as shelves and these are just for you know aesthetic decoration with little battery operated puck lights that i always got to recharge the batteries for i gotta wire these things so moving on to the guitar wall i have a fender telecaster right there and an ltd ec1000 is the black one um also an epiphone sg was my first ever electric and my gibson les paul so I used to tour the country in my late teens and early 20s, and I like to keep that vibe for stream. And yes, that's me. Free beard and eyeliner. Feels like a different life. After that, I do have a green screen corner. Um, as you can see though, I had to cut the green screen so I could pull up this little thing here and get around it. Unfortunately, I don't have much room in this corner. I did put a little mic here in case I wanted to do live stuff, but uh... now the original plan was to incorporate this live, but I couldn't really get it to look the way I wanted to, so I'm mostly gonna keep it to like off stream stuff. And that's how I made my custom loading screen, like you see here for Tarkov or any other game or scene that I use on live streams. But now to get to the meat, the good stuff, and I'll try to list as many things as I can on screen and in the description. So first off, the mouse I use is the Glorious Model O, and I love it. And then the keyboard is the Roquette Vulcan 121, complete with hairs in between the keys and a mustache comb in case things get wild. And I use two stream decks, one regular one and one XL one with custom little icons that I made in Photoshop. And moving on, I use a Go XLR for all my audio needs. Red, of course. And with the Go XLR, I have a dual PC setup, so I run a line in and out. And for voice, I run through a cloud lifter into, of course, a Shure SM7B. And for listening to things, I have a Bear Dynamic DT990 Pro. Uh, black edition these are my favorite i've had the regular edition before and i love it now for the stream pc i use a gmmk2 from glorious uh keyboard and a corsair vado mouse not a cameras and this right here is my main like face cam that you always see me use and it's a sony a7r2 um with a 24 millimeter 1.4 aperture f-stop i don't know a lot about cameras i'm trying this one's my gopro um, that I used to use for fishing actually, and I just repurpose it for stream. I have it hanging from the ceiling and that's the camera I usually use, you know, when I hit the, the flames, the smoke cannons. And then we have this one, which is like uh, one of the original webcams I used, the Logitech C922. Um, as you can see, massive difference between the two, <laughs> massive difference. Um, but what I did with this one is I repurpose this one and I run it through a, a program that no longer exists. I got lucky that I still have it. Um, to where I can get a face cam, uh, a, f a follow cam, sorry. So this is how I do like my head banging, you know, when I hit the lights and I'm jamming and stuff. This is how I do that. Well, the camera I use at least. And we also have the back cam here, which I love. Um, show off the setup a little bit. You know, when I have music going, the lights are uh, going along with the music, just like this. And this, this is all through like a Philips Hue bridge. And then I run like the desktop app. So it works on um, the lights I have behind the monitors the lights I have on each side of the desk. And then also I have those two, the same things that are behind my desk I have on each side of the couch. And then I have a Philips Hue light strip that also are all connected to the music. Um, the other light strips that I use, like this one here, as you see, it's not going to the music, as well as the one under here and the one wrapping the desk. Uh, that's just Govi, I think. But most importantly, can't forget this one. Foot cam, mm-hmm, for free. Now, I know what you're asking. Ash, why are you at your house sitting in a chair wearing your Air Force Ones? 
because they're new, I like them, and they match the fit. Now to light these cameras and lighting is important, I use two Dazny key lights, I guess they're called. Uh, they're like a cheaper version of the Elgato ones, but work great for me, always use them. And I found this little magnetic LED light that I use as like a hair light or rim light. Probably not the best, but whatever. Anyway, my baby, my new gaming PC from Stintsbuilt. I love this thing. Meet the Ass Slayer with an Intel i9 13900K, a 4080 graphics card, 64 gigs of DDR5 RAM, plus everything else I'm not reading. And they hooked it up with a blackout type effect with the red lights that just matches so well. And currently I am a partner with Stint, so if you want this exact build, you can literally buy it. I'll put the link in the description. But of course you need to have a matching little brother. And this is my stream PC, which is kind of a Frankenstein build. So it doesn't really have a name, but we can call it Lil Fella. So this was my first ever PC with the 2060 Super and the 3700X, but everything else pretty much got a massive upgrade from stints. And that includes adding an Elgato Cam Link Pro internally to help me with my cameras. But man, both of them together is just, Mm. Mm. I gotta stop looking at this. But to protect both of these, you can kind of see them there, little UPS batteries. And I currently sit in a Secret Lab Titan 2022, I think it is. And of course we can't forget my smoke geysers, my flames. And for that, I just run two 80J Volcano Fog Machines uh, next to each other on some cardboard. I do want to build like a decorative box around them though for the future. But if we move over here in this little hallway, I have my bathroom, which we're not gonna go into. So we get right into this closet I have where I keep a lot of my little boxes for things up top in case I need them. I'm a box hoarder. My wife wishes I wasn't, but at least I'm organized, right? It took me like two years to actually do this. Uh, hopefully you like the studio tour. Uh, hopefully I went into enough detail. I'm sure I forgot to film some things. I guess we'll see when I edit. Uh, I'll try to list every, as much as I can in the description or on screen specs and all that if I can. So um, hope you have a good one. I got shit to do.